my name is Nur Ain Suziani Binti Chahamid. I am recording this video for my e-portfolio assignment for reflection class. First of all, I will talk about my teaching philosophy. This is my metaphor that I've come came across uh, when I was in the second week of lecture of this course um, the metaphor is uh, teaching is like building a house um, in my opinion uh, the basic of what you are teaching is the most important things because um, if the basic uh, let's say if you are building a house if the basic of the base of the house is not strong then the upper part of the house will will crumble and will will not be effective it is the same with teaching because in teaching we are we need to teach the we need to have the strong basic uh, in example, we have we have to have a strong knowledge, especially in grammar, in our language, English language, mm, so that what we are going to teach to our students will be correct. So so that means we are not teaching the wrong things. So that is why when we as the teacher have to have the basic, uh, the strong basic of our knowledge, despite of whatever subject we are teaching. So in our context, English teachers, we we need to have the strong basic in language rules, such as grammar, vocab, uh, our pronunciation. We need to be strong in that particular area areas uh, and then um, in my own experience before this I thought that teaching is uh, a, teaching is, a, is an easy task uh, I thought that for us as the teacher we just need to enter the class and teach whatever it is but when I had my first KPD, the KPD one, and especially semester six, December, uh, I have entered reflection class. Uh, teaching is actually is a big, big task, and it has a very heavy responsibility uh, because. Teaching is not an easy task because what you are going to teach to your students is what they are going to to implement in their life. So we need to have we need to have uh, a lot of we need to have what you call it, um, we need to have the correct knowledge we need to have the strong basic in ourselves as the teacher um, <coughs> so for this uh, reflection class uh, it has taught me that uh, we as a human we we are not perfect so uh, in everything that we made especially in our teaching we need to always do reflections so that we can improve ourselves and we can see that uh, we need uh, we can't be arrogant although we might be teaching for 10 years 20 years but still we need to improve ourselves every day is a learning process so to improve ourselves to make ourselves better, we need to make reflections. 
We also can help uh, others, other peoples, to improve themselves also with reflections. Uh, it is, um, but for everyone, it is different. Some people can accept uh, uh, what other people commented on them, but some people can't. But it, this, this is the things that we need to have and and what we need to learn. We we need to be open minded so that we are not uh, at this. We are so that we are improving. If if other people are commenting us and we cannot accept that, that is for me in my opinion that is being being. Being in mature, mature. So for my for myself, uh, I hope that uh, I will be able to be a good teacher, a good teacher. Uh, I will be able to improve myself. Uh, I also need people around me to help me improving myself. Uh, by observing me uh, and uh, give me uh, a good comments, uh, the the comment that will not uh, demotiv demotivated me. Uh, okay, uh, that's all that I want to say for this video. Thank you.